we're now going to get into one of our favorite uh, apps in the world, and that's called the Quick app. Yeah. Q-U-I-K. So the first thing we want you guys to do is to download that app, please. And it looks like this. It's Q-U-I-K. It's a free app, so um, it's downloadable for you, yeah. It's a free app, and you guys are going to download that just to show you which one it is. Uh, in case you can't see the mouse, it is this one. That's the Quick app. It's free. It's made by GoPro. So you guys can go ahead and download that app. And we're going to show you how to use it now. That's the Quick app. And we're going to jump into the Quick app. Okay, so we're very quickly going to jump into the app. I just hit on the app um, button icon. And then I'm going to hit the button at the bottom. You can see it here. Okay, now that you're in that, you're in your camera vault. Effectively, we can take in videos or photos at this stage. As an initial experiment, we're gonna try this with just photographs. Yeah. And we believe that you can tell pretty much any story in six lines, six images, six sentences, and you can create a really quick 30 second video. Each of these questions should answer the following questions. Who, where, what, when, why, and how if you can tell me those six points of view across yeah. six images you can tell any story who is it what are they doing where are they doing it why are they doing it how and why yeah. wait i said why you said who where what when why how answer okay. those six you can tell absolutely any story and we're going to show it to you right now so let's grab six images and okay. we'll give you a quick quick demo so at this point i'm just going to grab these six images and this is a really cool story that i actually saw on the world skills website and we can take the world skills logo i'm going to take the world skills logo as well um and i'm going to hit the add button at the top add button up the top and it takes me into this thing Every single day. So at this point, it takes me into the screen, which is like themes. And here I can choose whatever theme I want. The transitions for the text is done. There's cool music, royalty free music. So you don't have to worry about copyright issues. Um, so there's all of these cool sort of. So you want to choose one. Don't worry too much about the music. You can always change it. So we're going to choose one of the themes. I'm just going to choose this one because I think it's cool. Um, the next thing I want to do is I want to go to the spanner at the bottom. Okay, so the spanner is kind of like a settings feature. Yep. Um, because as I, we said at the start, there's so many different formats that exactly. WorldSkills is interested in being on, so yeah. many different platforms. And this will enable you to export the same video in multiple platforms. Yes. So I'm going to go to the format. So format. There we go. Um, and here I can choose whether I want cinema style is landscape. Again, you just spoke about um, lean forward and lean back. I don't think we have spoken about this session okay. just yet. But um, so cinema style is landscape video. So if you want to do a video for YouTube or Facebook, Square obviously really great. For, really great for Instagram, and then portrait amazing for your Instagram stories and Snapchat stories. So here you want to choose the kind of footage that you have format of the footage you have. So the, the footage I have on this particular story is all landscapes. I'm going to choose cinema style. And then I'm going to hit OK at the bottom. Um, the, the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go to this little button right at, in the middle here. And it looks like a YouTube kind of button, I think. Okay, and I'm going to go there. And the, and the first thing I want to do is I want to reorder my images. I want to make it into the order that I, can, that I, that I want the linear story to be in. Um, so for this one, I'm going to go with this one first. She's holding each one down with her finger. Yeah. She's dragging and so dropping doing... them. And she's putting them in the order of the structure that she wants the story to be in, starting with the most provocative, emotive, uh, thought provoking uh, image and line of text. You really want to grab the audience's attention right at the top. Okay. So she's put them in the right order. Okay, right, what well, skills at the end? And then. Okay, so what I'm what I'm gonna do next is I wanna add text. So I'm gonna hit the pencil button. You can see the pencil button. So this is just a blank screen that I don't really want. And I, we don't want the title board. So I'm gonna hit delete at the bottom here. Okay, 
can is they take me to the next one. And very quickly, again, I'm going to think about the who, what, why, when, how. Who, where. Who, where, what, why, when, how. Yeah, there we go. There we go. And I'm going to basically answer those questions in each of the pictures. So for the first one, I'm going to say, um, so the name of this lady is, called, her name is Rebecca Wilson. It's winning in a man's world. What, when? So Yusuf is putting the five W's in the comment section. I'm going to go to the next one. I'm going to say um, she's a car painter from Ireland. So I've answered the, the where and the what in that one. And I'm going to say she just one runs at world skills. Thank you for being. Two words, one word. I need to point myself. Okay, and then I'm going to say she uh, finds gender uh, irrelevant. Gen um, finds. She finds gender irrelevant. Um, and she's. What, what else have I answered? Uh, you said what she does. I you said, said that she won. Yep. You said where. Yes. Uh, you said why. Mm -hmm. You said how she does it. Um, Maybe she's done it through years. Say she strives to be the best. Cool. Uh, yeah. Using both uh, traditional and new technologies. That's the how, I suppose. Yeah. So we've answered our questions, and right at the end on the World Skills logo, I'm just going to put the hashtag um, skills change lives. Cool. Cool. So I've added text to each one of them. I'm going to hit the OK button at the bottom. OK, so I don't really think that the music fits this piece. So I'm going to go to the music option here. And I'm going to choose something. OK, I think that's better. Again, I'm going to go back to the, to the middle icon. And I'm going to play the video. So we can actually, let's export to watch this full screen as well. So you're just going to hit the save button on the bottom right. If you're on uh, iPhone, you're going to hit, you go down to the bottom and go photo library. If you're on an iOS, you're going to hit save without sharing. That's going to come through to your library. We can make them make that full screen like so. And let's watch our there we masterpiece. Go. So it's saved to my camera roll. There we go. California Cola, midday text. Cool. So that shows you how easy it is to make a quick piece of video. I want to try doing the same thing, this time in vertical, and something that we could effectively make and quick and take up to Instagram stories, and this time with a series of videos. Okay. So I'm going to start off with a little video introduction. Uh, I'm going to fix the cameras myself, and I'm going to say, Hey, we are doing a cool, cool world skills workshop, and Crispin is going to tell you exactly why. So that's my first video, uh, and then we're going to have the video of Crispin. We're then going to say we are using mobile phones to create engaging video content, like that. And what else can we do? Um, we're going to say. Of the day, what about engaging with people both on mobile phones and on bigger screens like a laptop? Cool, and then we're going to jump back into quick, and this time we're going to show you how to edit a video a series of video shots on quick. So, plus button again, grabbing all of the videos that we're going to need one, two, three, four, and Crispin coming in at five. And 
There he is. And we're also going to grab the uh, promo video that we saw earlier today at the start of this presentation. Uh, oh, I see. Let's go with these ones then. And we're going to add that. And the same thing that we're going to do again, we're going to find the theme for, uh, that's going to define what uh, kind of effect we want. So any of these themes will do. And this time we're going to click on the YouTube button again. And we're going to put them in the right order. So we're going to listen to each one. Okay, this goes with us. Cool, cool world skills. And the first thing we're going to do is click on the little settings button on the bottom. The little spanner. Today it's all about engaging with Turn it to, to, last, to a vertical yeah. video. So that looks a lot better already. And we're going to put them in the right order. So that's the first one. That comes up at the top as follows. The second one is uh, Crispin's Bite. That comes in there. We then come to the mobile phone as the third one. We then come to myself as the fourth, and we can actually delete the fifth. Um, cool. We're then going to add a line of text onto each one. So we're going to delete that opening title board, and we're going to write a line of text on this one, uh, saying, doing a cool workshop. Okay, we're then going to go, no, sorry, we're then going to go along to the trim function, and... So right here is the trim function at the bottom. You're going to hit trim, cool, cool, then you're going to click on the manual skill. at the bottom, and we're going to do an in and out to make sure that my start and end is right. The start already is fine, because I start right at the top of that, and we're going to trim that like that, and we're going to press the OK button. We're going to click on volume, and we're going to press that till it says boost, and that's going to take primarily my audio. We're then going to take Crispin again. We're going to click the trim button. Told, I'm the director of marketing and communications for World Skills. Uh, amazing trainers. It's really dynamic. And we're going to take a little three or four seconds bite from him. Session. I hope that you all. I'm in Abu Dhabi. I Just like that. And we're going to press OK. And we're going to say uh, volume. volume again twice. And this time, and again, we're going to put a piece of text mobile on Crispin. Mobile phones to create engagement. And this one is the mobile phones one. We're going to say OK. We're going to, this time, keep the volume exactly as it is. But we're going to go back to Crispin. We're going to add a light, light lane of text. We're going to say, uh, meet the director of comms. Um, just like that. And we've got that shot. And then the final shot. Uh, do you want a texture? Uh, mobile. We can go Mojo. Uh, and then the final one, uh, we can say the big screens too. And we're going to trim this one. So the day is all about engaging with people both on mobile phones and on bigger screens, like a lap. And we're going to say OK. And in a couple seconds, we've created a little video for you guys. But at the end quick. of the day, it's all about engaging we're with people. Hey, we hit the save button. And uh, on the first one, let's also uh, get a mix of audio so that we have that. Music, whoops. Music but at the end up. of the day, it's all about engaging so with people both. The first one, we're going to click on the pencil button, and we're going to add, uh, press that again, and there we go. And we should be done. We're going to press save. And that is how quickly using Quick you can create your own little video. Uh, yes, in and out, you can change the music levels, uh, Crispin. You click on that volume button, press it once, and it turns the music off. So it's, uh, there's no audio at all. Yeah. Press it another time, and it takes a, mi a mix of both yourself and the, or the, sorry, the interviewee and the or music. Press it twice for boost, and it will prioritize uh, just the person's voice. Uh, this is a vertical video, so we're going to play it in vertical for you guys. Here's what it looks like. In a cool, cool world skills workshop, and this is going to tell you exactly why. I'm in Abu Dhabi. I can't speak to you live from Abu Dhabi. Facebook is blocked live, but I'll be following the session. I'll be contributing throughout. Before we are using mobile phones to create engaging content. But at the end of the day, it's all about engaging with people both on mobile phones and on bigger screens like a laptop. Woohoo! That was easy, right? <laughs> You're giving yourself a clap. I'm giving you a clap, <laughs> a slow clap. 
anyway so we can, we can go back to um to quick yeah and it's a really cool simple app um easy to do easy to create um cool videos for facebook where you're just adding pictures or videos with text and with music um and they're really good and they travel well on the internet as well cool